Korea's consumer sentiment, a consumer sentiment index, rather, a key indicator of future consumption, has risen to its highest level in almost seven years. November's index shows that people are expecting the real estate market to cool down and the Bank of Korea to raise interest rates. Our Kim Ji-an reports. Consumer sentiment reached its highest level in more than six years and 11 months in November as relations between South Korea and China improved and geopolitical risks stemming from North Korean threats waned. Data by the Bank of Korea shows the composite consumer sentiment index has risen by more than three points from the previous month to 112.3. The index jumped during the February to July period on high expectations after a newly elected government, but dropped for two consecutive months leading up to September on rising North Korean provocations. A reading above 100 means more people are optimistic than pessimistic about the economy. The same data showed less people expect the strong upward trend in real estate prices to continue, mainly due to government measures unveiled earlier this year to curb housing speculation. It was the first time since July that consumer sentiment on real estate prices dropped, falling to 106, down four points from the previous month. Expectations on rises in household incomes stayed the same as the previous month at 104, while job prospects rose for the first time in five months. Expectations of an interest rate hike reached their highest level since July 2011, in anticipation that the Bank of Korea will raise the main benchmark interest rate later this month from the current record low of one and a quarter percent. There was a dissenter who called for an interest rate hike in last month's BOK Monetary Policy Committee, and robust Q3 growth on the back of surging exports could provide support for such a move. The expert added, however, that since a rate hike would put more burden on households in repaying their debt, he projected that the BOK will be more cautious in raising the interest rate next year. Kim Jian, Arirang News.